everyone beta today we are going to go ahead and we are going to look at iit jam economics macroeconomic weightage ki macroeconomics ka over different years what has been the weightage right now let us try to also look at the different topics that have been asked in macroeconomics over the different years and I will also give you example of those topics. Okay. First of all, let's talk about the year 2021. So please understand question 1 to 10, they are for 1 marks. Question 10 to 30 are for 2 marks. Question 30 to 40 are for 2 marks. Question 41 to 50 are for 1 mark. And question number 51 to 60 are for 2 marks. 100 marks. Okay. Let's look at the weightage of uh, weightage in year 2021 macroeconomics. So 1 mark, 2 marks. 2 marks, 2 marks, 2 marks, 2 marks, 2 marks, 1 mark, 2 marks, 2 marks, 1 mark, 1 mark, and 2 marks. 6, 8, 10. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22 marks out of 100 was in year 2021 for macroeconomics. Take care. Similarly, if we go ahead and if we look at 2022 paper beta, to kitna marks ka raha? 2, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 149 that means 1 2 1 2 1 18 2 2 1 and 2 2 4 6 8 10 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 so 25 marks weightage was in the year 2022. So that means that it increased from 22 to 25. Let's look in the year 2023 beta. So in the year 23, this is 2, 2, 2, sorry, 1, 2, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 2, and 1. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. It dropped. It dropped to 18. Okay. Let's look at the last one. Last year's paper, 2024. So it is 1, 1, 2, 2, 1, 2, 2, 2, 2, 1, 1, 2, 2, and 1. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 22 marks. Right. So we can think that on an average, macroeconomics is for 20 to 25 marks. Can we say that? So on an average, 20% to 25% better. In IIT Jam Economics paper, it will be macroeconomics. Now, let's see what are the most often asked questions in macroeconomics. The most often asked question, sabse pehle ek question ISLM model se aega hi aega. Not only one, there will be more. These questions can be on finding ISLM equations equilibrium. They can be on finding the government policy multiplier. They can be on finding fiscal policy multiplier, monetary policy multiplier. They can be on the slope and shift of the ISN curve, right? Then 
every year it has been seen regardless of the year that there has been a question on solo model mane aap solo model ko skip nahi kar sakte ho because solo model itself if you see year 2022 there were four questions on solo model so you cannot skip that hai na aur abhi bhi in other years also at least you are seeing two marks solo model question is coming right so solo model is important similarly every year they have asked a question on the definition of unemployment definition of unemployment mane they can ask you find unemployment rate they can ask you find employment rate theek okay? hai they can ask you something related to unemployment data but unemployment pe ek na ek question they can ask you question on this year suppose they can ask you question on wage uh, setting price setting relationships right so every year related to labor market related to unemployment you will see a question okay although since last two year there has been no question on comparing classical versus keynes but this is a common topic they can ask you question on comparing classical versus keynesian model to ye bhi ek important topic hai which you should be studying then gdp mein beta the inclusions in gdp that what is included and what is excluded from gdp is pe bhi there can be a question which can be asked in exam and you have to thoroughly study that topic that theek hai uh, is uh, which kind of income is not included in gdp right what is included in gdp us pe dhyan se aapko analysis karna hoga every year there is a question on philips curve augmented philips curve what is philips curve Uh, what is rational expectation? What is adaptive expectation? On that topic, you will go ahead and you will see a question every year. Okay. Then, but a open economy. Open economy is vast. Okay. There can be question on BOP. I have seen coming in the past, Mundell Fleming model. Okay. Uh, open economy multiplier, right? And there can be questions which can be asked. on uh, capital mobility perfect capital mobility imperfect capital mobility uh, marshall learner condition j curve hai na ye topics main hai you have to do them okay now ockham's law is a favorite topic of gate economics actually utna aap uh, ockham's ko isme nahi dekhoge jitna aap gate economics mein ockham's law ko dekhoge so it has been seen that over last two years there has been no question on ockham's law but जस्ट वन लाइनर डेफिनेशन है तो ये लॉज आपको याद होने चाहिए वॉट इज टेलर लॉ वॉट इज ओकून लॉ हाँ वॉट इज फिलिप्स कर्व इक्वेशन वॉट इज ए एस कर्व इक्वेशन यू रिमेंबर इन क्लास वी हैव डन द रिलेशन बिटवीन दीज थ्री टूगेदर ऑल्सो कि ये तीनों एक तीसरे से एक दूसरे से कैसे लिंक्ड है तो वो भी आपको पता होना चाहिए राइट ओके देन बेटा इट हैज बीन सीन दैट in 2022 and 24 there was no question on consumption theory but in 2000 and 21 and 23 there was a question on consumption theory or consumption theory pe maine aapko i think i've given you two assignments and they are very important life cycle hypothesis permanent income hypothesis in pe numerical can be asked in exam Right, I am expecting a numerical this year on on them. So try to do them. Then you have quantity theory, right? Then endogenous growth model. Last year there was a unique question which was talking about Romer model. Okay, so our syllabus is limited. Hai. AK model, Romer model, Solo model, and Harrod Romer. We only have to do these four for IIT. Ke liye. We only have to do these four for IIT. so try to do all these four models thoroughly from the point of view of exam i will take one separate marathon on these models and i'll try to do some numericals on these models also right this is rarely asked in exam inflationary deflationary gap theek okay? hai so i am just keeping it untouched for now uh it's not a very important thing it's not very difficult also it's just the gap which makes inflationary or deflationary uh, gap ha huh? but try to look at this 2022 question number 43 try to revise this taki aap isko ek bari concept ko dekh lo ki kaise humne kiya hai class mein at last there can be question on money 
money means money multiplier hmm? money means anything related to rbi anything related to monetary tools slr crr etc so this is also what is important so majorly speaking beta macroeconomics can be divided in these topics i have just made a note of this right and <clears throat> this is how you can split uh, and see the weightage from year to year 22 25 18 22 so approximately 22 25% of the paper is just macroeconomics and it is important to focus on macro thoroughly theek hai beta stay tuned in the upcoming video videos i will show you similar weightage of statistics plus econometrics of indian economy and of maths also i have already prepared those i already have those prepared i will just go ahead and discuss those with you in detail okay beta thank you